In this video, I'm going to show you how to instantly fix a stuffy nose. Stay tuned. Hey everyone, Dr. Rowe coming to you from Spine Care in St. Joseph, Michigan. In this video, I'm going to show three ways to quickly relieve a stuffy nose, even within 30 seconds. And we're going to cover all of the bases with this one, targeting sinus and nasal congestion to helping to improve lymph flow to flush out mucus and bad bacteria. All three methods work just a little bit differently. So go through them all, use what gives you the most relief. As a bonus, all of the exercises can be done at home and require no equipment. So with that being said, let's get started. So here's a really good one. I call this one the 30 second stuffy nose fix. It's an old outdoorsy trick that can be a literal lifesaver, especially if you have a lot of snot being formed from cold weather. First, let's identify which nostril is more clogged up. Just take two fingers, put them off to one side, clamp down on your nose, and then take a deep breath in. What you're gonna notice is if you have a lot of snot buildup, or should I say boogers in there, you are going to not have a lot of airflow. So double check and see which side is a little bit more stuffy to begin with. With me, it feels a little bit more on that right side. So this one is really, really easy to do. You're going to close off the side that it has a little bit more airflow. So again, I'm focusing on my right side. I'm going to close off the left side of my nose just by pushing on it. From there, I'm going to take my thumb right here on the clogged nose side and put it right below the cheekbone. So just take your thumb right here and trace right below your cheekbone. What you wanna do is hook upward with this and then stabilize off to the side with your fingers. So you're pushing up as much as you can comfortably and what you're going to do now is take a deep breath in. And what you're going to notice is, is that this mechanically will open that up just a little bit more so you can breathe a little bit easier. So what I like to do is take five deep breaths in, just nice and slowly. And what you're going to notice is this will really help open up that nasal passage and probably unclog that stuffy nose. And for good measure, I would do this on the other side, but this is something that you can do throughout the day and it just really mechanically will help open up the nose and hopefully relieve that stuffy nose. So this one is going to be the total package. It's going to help relieve sinus and nasal congestion while also helping to improve lymph flow to flush out mucus and bad bacteria. It's called the tongue and finger method and it's really easy to do. In the first part, we're going to focus on vibrating the vomer bone, which is a long, thin bone that lies right in the middle of the nasal cavity. You can imagine if we can get that to shake, it will really break up congestion, all that gunk in our nose causing drainage, and hopefully just get rid of that stuffy nose. So start off by taking your tongue and pressing it to the roof of your mouth as much as you can. You're going to hold that position during this first part. And for demonstrative purposes, I'm not going to do it because I wouldn't be able to speak otherwise. So after you're in that position, take a finger, I like to use my thumb right here, and press right above the top of your nose. Press in there very gently to where you're going to get a good self-massage but not causing discomfort. So after you've done that, what you're going to do is a slight motion, taking your thumb right here from side to side. This should create kind of like a tickle over the nasal cavities and also into your nose, which is good. We're trying to really shake up that congestion, breaking it up to get drainage. Do this for 15 to 20 seconds and then relax. Next, what I'm going to do is target off to the side to hit the uh, sinuses just a little bit differently. So take two thumbs this time around and start right on the top of the nose in the corner of the eye sockets. Again, you're going to press your tongue up towards the roof of your mouth. And then you're just going to do the shaking motion again for about 15 to 20 seconds. Afterwards, relax and repeat this whole cycle for about three repetitions. But if you feel like you need a little bit more, by all means, throw in another repetition or two. Let's take this one to the next level by now focusing on the maxillary sinuses, which are right off to the side of the nose. And with this one, you might want to have a tissue ready because it can really open up the nose, causing that Niagara Falls so definitely don't be caught off guard. This one is really easy to do. And for these next two steps, you don't have to take your tongue to the roof of your mouth. Just do the light massage instead. Take two fingers, start right at the top of the nose. You're going to press into the skin, hook it, and then pull over and then down 
over the cheekbone. So you're just gonna grab in there, go over like this. And then on the next repetition, go a little bit lower and repeat. You're going to or do this whole process going from the top of the nose, working your way down towards the bottom. Once you get to the bottom, start over again and do this whole thing for about three complete repetitions. And hopefully that really does open it up very quickly. But after we start to get drainage, what we want to do is now focus on flushing it out by increasing lymph flow. Here's a really easy way to be able to do that. Take your hand, the edge of it right here on the pinky side and place it right off to the uh, side right here, right below the jaw. This movement is very easy. We're going to press in there and then sweep down. But as we sweep down, we're going to open our hands and create kind of like a fan with our fingers and then go over the front part of the throat for a nice good self massage. So watch how I do this. I press in there, I sweep down. As I come down, I open up my fingers and now fan them over the front part of my throat. And I like to do this one for about five to 10 repetitions. Afterwards, I wanna go a little bit lower, pretty much right at the bottom of the throat. So take two fingers and press right at the top of the collarbone right here. What you're focusing on is going towards the top and then off to the side on the outside of the collarbone right here. And you should start to feel two little holes, two little divots. Those are the areas that we want to focus on. So I'm gonna take two fingers on both sides for this one, go right above those holes, press into the skin, pull down into that hole. And this is just going to help again, increase limb flow. I like to do this one nice and slowly for about five to 10 repetitions. But afterwards, see how you feel. I really hope that that really helps your stuffy nose. And this is something that you can do throughout the day. So with this exercise, we're actually going to focus above the nose into the frontal sinuses. When these sinuses get clogged from allergies or just the common cold, it can lead to a lot of issues, including nasal congestion. So with this one, we're going to focus on opening up, unclogging those sinuses, getting a lot of drainage to hopefully flush mucus and bad bacteria out. So again, with this one, what we're going to focus on is the side that is most congested. So just take two fingers, put it off to the side of the nose, and take a deep breath in. I'm sorry for the nasty noises during this video, but what you're gonna do is focus on the side that is most clogged up. For me, it's definitely this left side right now. So I'm going to take my thumb on the left side and what I'm going to do is trace on the side of my nose, keep going up to the top of the nose into the corner of the eye socket. I know it looks really weird with this one. And if you do have long nails, definitely use caution with this. But you're going to apply enough pressure into the corner of the eye socket where it's going to be a very good self massage, not causing any discomfort. What you're going to do now is target the back of the head over these muscles called suboccipitals. The great part about this exercise is not only are we going to help open up the sinuses, but we're also gonna get a good headache relief, especially allergy and tension headache relief by targeting these muscles on the back of the head. So take your thumb right here and go right on the right side of your head or the opposite side of your other hand right here. You're going to just press into those muscles until you find that one spot that is just really tight and achy. Maybe it's just like a big muscle knot or spasm going on. You're going to press into it at that point, and then you're going to hold this one for 15 to 20 seconds. From there, relax, and then repeat this one three to five times. And with each repetition, build into it just a little bit more. Apply enough pressure in there because it's only going to help open up these sinuses. Afterwards, see how you feel. Hopefully, it does open it up. A lot of times, if it is clogged up, you will get like Niagara Falls coming down. So, I mean, it just opens up those nasal cavities and it just flows flushes things out. So definitely have a couple tissues ready in case that does happen. From there, I like to target different spots of the sinuses to make sure that we cover all bases. So I'm going to pretty much apply pressure on the back of my head, finding that one spot. But instead of going right towards the corner of the eye, I'm going to go right on the top of the nose. And then I'm going to apply pressure there and repeat. From there, I'm going to go right up into the forehead and then also hit that spot. I also like to go towards the side right here into the uh, pretty much the corner of the eyebrows, hitting that spot. And then I also like to go right over the temple. If you take your fingers right here and kind of press right into the side of the head, you'll feel like, in a, like a divot or a hole starting to form. And you really want to focus on pressing into that area also. This is a hot spot for headaches. So anytime that you feel a headache starting to come on or you have one, 
target this spot first. You might get relief within 30 seconds. But from there, I just like to see how I'm feeling. You'll probably find that one certain spot of those sinuses really feels like it's helping out the most. And I do try to throw more repetitions in at that point. And I do recommend switching to the other side too, just to keep everything in balance. So let's end the video by helping each other out with a friendly competition of who can share the best natural way or remedy to get rid of a stuffy nose. So if you have a great way that you would like to share, definitely leave it in the comments section below. We'll decide the winner by the comment that gets the most likes or thumbs up and comments that help support it. And to the winner, I will make a short video personally thanking you and trying to demonstrate your method the best that I can. So let the competition begin. In closing, if the exercise has helped, please support the channel by giving this video a like and maybe subscribing to the channel too. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks for watching.